Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to clean up your music in your iTunes library. This includes fixing music tags, missing covers, duplicate tracks, and much more. So the first step of course is to launch Tunes Go. After that we're going to make sure we're in the iTunes library and in the Music tab. And we have two methods, we can either automatically clean them up or we can manually clean them up. To automatically do so, we're going to go to the top right and click on this Clean Up button. We can go ahead and scan first off to see how many missing tags, missing covers, duplicate tracks, or missing tracks we have. And once it's finished with the scan, it will tell you how much of a mess your iTunes library is. So let's clean it up. So first off, we're going to click on Missing Tags. And it's going to display all of the missing tag songs it's found. So we'll go ahead and click on Fix, and it's going to start going through and fixing as many of these songs as it can. And once it's finished fixing all those music tabs, we can go ahead and click on Save and it's going to save all of those to the actual files. If we go down to fix music covers, we can actually try and find the cover art for a lot of these songs. So we'll go ahead and click on get covers, and it's going to start searching and applying any covers it finds. And once that process is complete, it will apply any of the cover art it has found to your files. Now for the duplicate songs deleter, it will automatically select all of the duplicate songs for us. So we can go ahead and just click on delete duplicates and click on OK. Now it's going to go through and get rid of all of those double files. And when it's finished, it's going to go ahead and say all the duplicates have been deleted. And finally, let's take a look at cleaning up missing tracks. In this case, I just have one, so I'll click on clean. And it's just going to delete that for me since there is no actual reference file, which means that basically it wouldn't play at all if we tried to. You can also go to the toolbox tab and click on clean up iTunes library, and that will bring up the same options as we explored before. And the other method we can use is to manually fix these. This is useful for changing any of the ID tags. So inside of our iTunes library, we'll right click on a file and go to edit music info. And within here, we can add things like the year, the genre, the album name, and everything like that. Of course, manually doing this for a lot of files is not going to be very efficient. So it's best to do it when you have just a few or even after automatically cleaning up your library. But once you're finished with your changes, just click on the save button and it's going to automatically update that inside of your iTunes library. And that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. That is how you clean up the music in your iTunes library.